in this shoe making video i want to show you the entire process of making shoes the full process on how to make shoes so you will decide if this craft for you or not so for example i have here a few examples of leather and it looks like very soft and nice leather but when i approach to last it especially shoe last with the pointed toe how you will manage to last the toe here that's why these essential tools are important for you on the other hand there are a lot of diy tools also the instep here is much higher than it was before and it fits perfectly to the instep of this foot and of course pencil lays on, on the ground and then take ruler with straight angle place it in the way where the edge of the shoe last touches the this side of the ruler and check where is the edge of the shoe last on the scale of the ruler pattern making will help you to know how to assemble all these parts together edges of lining i will not cut because they are not good we'll attach edge of the upper now i don't need to close these folds because this amount of nails right now is enough i will use here leather stiffeners and then i will place this leather stiffeners here and i will close them leather thick leather that you can use to create here this cover of your last shoes so how to do it most important thing is to create to keep it in the same angle that this blade has not move like this not like this try to hold it in the right angle and move along this sandpaper this perforation consists from one big hole and between each big hole we have two small holes you can make it by eyes in a distance of one millimeter and for comfortable shoes is one of the best lining leather to work with goat skin or also calf skin is good also for lining but if you can't draw this line precisely work with this kind of tool that you can prepare by yourself again and work with the edge that I started to work with at first. To have precise set central line, use the ruler to and draw central line in the front part of the shoe. Last here we need to have gap on the distance of two millimeters where the heel touches the wall. Take simple pencil and place it to the longest toe. We need to scarf like this and you start to scarf from the edge of the blade. Remove the blade and continue to sky a little bit with the hammer check it again by placing like this there is a difference between inner side and outer side the, the shoe last has a symmetrical edge you will be able to attach many layers and create different heel height color i will work with red dye color two types of reinforcement tapes and where to use them and many other tools why we need this type of thread and what this this type is memory foam to create extra comfort and because of the thickness of the foam we have this uh, kind of volume in the shoeless and you can work with this tool dremel it's untraditional shoemaking tool and it's very useful in shoemaking 